continually reliving it. Since the crash happened, everything changed. It has been more than 10 years since a drunk driving crash turned their lives upside down. Reggie Steffi landed in the state penitentiary for intoxication manslaughter. He was 20 years old. Jackie Sabarito lost her looks, her independence, and her hopes for a bright future. Some mistakes last forever. Twenty years old when I was sentenced to prison, and I was twenty-seven years old when I got out. It's not what you see on TV, um, but it's it's not a place anybody wants to go. I would have much rather gone to college, out of high school, than gone to prison. Basically, I'm at a 10-year um, setback in terms of all of the stages of life that one usually goes through. You can let it get you down and quit, or just keep taking one step at a time. It's, uh, it'll still be a long road. The accident will always be a part of my life. Uh, it's not something I could change, um, but it's also not something I'm able to describe to anybody else. Uh, it's not something that'll ever go away. It can be forgiven, but it can't be forgotten. It's made a lot of people aware of the dangers of drinking and driving, how serious one night can be. It's all it takes. If anything that I've gone through can uh, have an effect on, on the decisions that somebody chooses to make, um, I just hope that it has. I just hope that it has. Uh, I think the crash changed everything. I couldn't continue my career. I couldn't continue uh, dancing. And, uh, I cannot go to the beach like I did it before. Uh, I don't hang out like before with friends. I need more time than uh, a normal person needs. I need special conditions, sometimes that I don't like, but this is the reality. So almost 10 years uh, after the accident, um, uh, I see better. I can do things better with, with my f with my hands. Um, but I have to take care of my skin. Um, I, I still have low vision, and I think uh, I'll, I never will have what I want to have or what I have before. Right now, and a little bit pessimistic and, and confused. So I'm 30, so I, I don't know exactly what I'm going to do. It has been so hard all of this time. And right now I'm trying to, to concentrate, to accept what happened. And my life is going to be like this, so I don't know. It has, it has, been, it, it has been so difficult. I faced my depression 
with the support of my father, my family, my friends. Before the accident, I used to be independent and self-sufficient, and now I, I need I need to to ask for help. If I have a wish, I would like to to have a, a normal body, to not be disabled, to have vision, to have my hands back, my normal skin, my regular appearance. Um, to to have a, a normal life.